Jen Mueller, expert talker here with an important question for you. Are you missing out on the most valuable piece of the newspaper? Now, it doesn't matter if you actually pick up the newspaper and read it, or if you just check headlines and news topics online. If you are skipping the sports section, you are missing out. I saw a woman do this just last week on a plane. She read everything else in the newspaper and she just cast the sports section aside. Here's what she's missing out on and what you could be missing out on too. Being able to talk about sports gives us another connection point in the office. That connection point makes it a whole lot easier to engage in conversations with your coworkers, colleagues, and potential clients. The easier those conversations, the more productive they are, the more business gets done, the more opportunities you have. Do you see the correlation there? If you skip the sports section, you're eliminating a very large subject matter that you could be talking about. And let's face it, ladies, if you work in an office place with a lot of guys, this is going to be key for building those relationships. In the next month, I want you to start picking up the sports section and I want you to watch for these things. I actually made a list of things that you need to be watching for. The first one, the BCS rankings. They come out for the first time this week. They're the college football rankings that determine who will play for the national championship at the end of the year. They will get updated now every week until the end of the season so you can keep track of the top ranked teams. If you're watching NFL games, I got to tell you, keep an eye on the Green Bay Packers and the Detroit Lions. You know, everybody thought that the Packers were going to be good this year. They are, in fact, the defending Super Bowl champions, but the Lions... That is a shocker. You know, it was just a few years ago that they did not win a single game in their entire season. So the fact that they're undefeated now is absolutely stunning. Here's the other little twist to that story that football fans are really paying attention to. There's only been one team in the history of the game, the 1972 Dolphins, that completely ran the tables and won every single game. So football fans are now wondering who can go the deepest into the season without suffering a loss. That's a little nuance there for you to keep track of. If you're a basketball fan, well, college hoops just around the corner in a few weeks, you'll see some non-conference matchups in the middle of November, and that's going to have to tide you over because it really looks like the NBA season will be canceled. The league has already canceled the first two weeks of the season, and it's likely that by the end of the month, we will see the entire season canceled. They have been locked out for quite a while and the owners and the players cannot come together on an agreement. We will have a new World Series champion to celebrate though by the end of the month and it's going to be brand new because the Phillies were knocked out. They are finishing up now with the Cardinals and the Brewers in the National League and in the American League. It is the Tigers and the Rangers. One team from each of those matchups will then play for the World Series. So that's what I want you to watch out for. It's not this month. It's not just this month, I should say. It is every month, which is why every month you can find a new edition of Talk Sporty to Me on the Girl Power Hour blog, but you can also check out the website to learn how these conversations can be effective in the workplace. It is TalkSportyToMe.com.